Hi everyone, today we're going to take a look at this here smart thermostat. This one I really like because it works with Google Home Hub and it also works with Alexa which is another little bonus and obviously it's all controllable by your mobile phone. So let's have a close look at it shall we? So here we have my smart thermostat with your central heating. Turn it on, it stays on for a little while and as you can see it's a lovely display in there. It goes off after a little while because it's just for a, a touch and see. Now this is manual if you want it. If you've not got a connection to the internet and your phone is not connected, uh, it can be used in full manual mode override. If you've got a connection though, it won't. Alright, so let's have a look at the app, shall we? Here is the app, my smart thermostat. So, when you get the main screen up, you get a bit of weather forecast as well partly cloudy which is, is about right but it's a nice warm day today so we got thermostat and it's already on it's connected to my phone a little bit of grief connecting it wasn't quite as easy as other liked but if you can persevere it does get there in the end so it's not too bad there's lots of things on this but I'm just going to mainly show you the actual programming part of it so if we go to the thermostat now and here we have it and it's a very nice looking kind of setting thing there isn't it, it looks really quite nice, you can, you can just flick the temperature up and down like this, um, very easy. There's lots of settings on it for different functions, uh, lots of on and off times on it as well. Here's the details of the device, as you can see the usual thing, the name, where mine is in the hall. This, this actual app will control lots of different devices, obviously the same as most of them do these days. It will control up to six, you can name all the rooms. Um, as you can see there, I've got Google Assistant, which is good for me, and a lot of people have got Amazon's Alexa, which it will work with. As you can see, the weather app gives you a lot more information. You can see exactly what it's doing outside temperature. This here is the more services page and as you can see there's Alexa and Google for you if you have those to set up with your system. It's great because I can just say uh, hey Google turn on the heating or so on or set the temperature and it will do it all for me which is great isn't it? So we'll take a look now at the schedule setting as you can see I've set it to the actual hall setting now which shows a little picture in the background very nice let's go to the schedules and here you can see the schedules there's six time periods so it's not too bad and plus you have obviously a Saturday and a Sunday one so installation pretty easy actually although I'm quite lucky my son in law is an electrician so <laughs> no problem for me but as you can see it is just live and neutral and the switched wire there you can see so it's four wires not too bad, he done it in a GIF, but then he is a, he is a trained electrician and if you're at all worried about fitting this thing please please get a registered electrician to do it for you okay so we'll just go over the brochure and there's a quick setting there for the front screen and this screen here is the one on setting the functions and options of which there's plenty I'm not going to go through them all the last piece of information here as I say if you want to read more do just pause the video there I'm not going to leave it on that though there we are if you'd like some smart heating you only need to change the thermostat and it will sort your heating especially easy for us with combi boilers uh, obviously because uh, you only need to leave it set heating and let the thermostat control it which is what this does really great I think for the money I'll give a link for it um, I bought it from Amazon as usual but it was a really good price I had one before it started playing up I decided to have a look around for one that doesn't use batteries in there this one doesn't there's no batteries it's main straight in and my other one had batteries they kept going flat and losing all the settings so I decided to do something about it let's have a look what there is around and this one Amazon has actually got no bad stars reading at all it's all five stars so I took it as pretty good and so far yes it is very good so if you want one great device look at that they're lovely the way, the light, light, the way it lights out okay that's about it for me all my stuff you know to go usual place Derek and Fairy Free thanks for watching guys bye bye